Hey guys, what's going on? It's the Witch Doctor, and I got a UU match this time for you guys. Uh, this match is really good. It was close at the end, and I, you'll you'll see. Let me play it back. So, is it off with a clam pearl, and I did not expect that. Well, I forgot to say the name, uh, Ibani Allure, I think. But anyways, uh, I taunt him thinking he was gonna go for the shell smash just to like do something clever. And uh, he actually goes for the surf and gets me out of my sash, so I said, screw it, let me just set up my rocks, and, you know, Aerodactyl did his job, but uh, it would have been nice to have it still, but, uh, he predicts me, and I was going to go for the Volt Switch, but of course, then in Marowak, it would have been a smarter play to go for the Hidden Power Ice, but I didn't. So he's actually going to get a sub off right now, and he's actually going to focus, and, uh, I don't know if that thing just outsped me, but, uh, I don't know. That focus punch one shots me though, so uh, there goes my Flygon, another useful Pokemon that could have came in handy, but he died. So he predicts my hidden power ice and actually goes into Durant, I was like, ah, it still did a good chunk. And this Iron Head, even though it's resisted, also did a good chunk because I'm more especially defensive. And I go for the Pursuit because I know he was going to switch out, and I got him with it. So he goes with a Snobble. And, you know, I don't see that this looks more of a RU team than anything. So, he, I go with a pursuit just to see how much it would do. He goes for a super fan and cuts me in half, so, oh well. I decide to, like, switch out into my King Boo, and, uh, I'm gonna set up a calm line as he protects. Now, this team is a, it's a Rest Hawk Spirit team, and, uh, instead of having Rest of Chesto, it's just Rest with Leftovers. Due to the sleep mechanics, because, you know, it doesn't matter, like, how long you're, uh, asleep or whatever. So, I decided to just, you know, do what Tim would do. And, uh, it works out pretty well. He talks to me, but I get to get off two combines, and I actually get a dark pulse off. No, 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 I tweaked. This is like, I thought I was asleep already, because it'll come into play soon. So using the emphasis, I'm going to keep combining the Toxic is taking its toll and the Leak Seed. So I got to just rest it off. And that's what I'm going to do as he protects, I believe. And yes, I, I rest it off. That's exactly what I thought I did. So he's going to get more help back from the Leak Seed, even though he got Max. So the Clan Pro comes in, and I'm going to go for the Sleep Talk, and I actually get the Dark Pulse, which was so good. So I got rid of the Clan Pearl, even though it's Clam Pearl, but NBZ knows how to use a Clam Pearl, so I don't underestimate it. This Exeter does a lot, because I don't know... Yeah, but that's almost not being my I'm sorry. But, uh, yes, yeah, so Exeter is a good chunk, and, yeah, I think my spirit team, so he's gone already. <sighs> so, bring in Sweet Queen, finish it off with a skull, and let's do it. This does so much damage just because of that puzzle. Like, you know, I didn't think. I gotta start using it. That's all I gotta say. I need to start using it. Anyway. So it goes into Drift Limp, and this part should have really sped it up. I don't know if I should, but I don't know if I was leave it there. This Drift Limp, I totally forgot about it. Dream World ability to get to the Flame Boost, I think it's called. I mean, he's in the also of Econ Mining, and so am I. But uh, luckily, I don't actually get the skull burn on him. I don't know what I was thinking. I should have ice beam on this guy, but I think I don't. I forgot what move I actually have on it. But this sweet thing, I really don't even know what moves I have on it, period. So I, I, I just kept. It should have had ice beam, but he crits me with a thunderbolt. Wow. And sweet thing goes down. Sweet thing goes down. So, I'm going to go into my Jolteon and get a Hidden Power Ice just to see how much it does and barely live that Shadow Ball. Oh my god, I love you Jolteon, because Jolteon is such a beast. And I get my own crit back to, you know, take down that uh, Drift Blimp. But I didn't think it mattered because he didn't have that much HP left, so I'm sure I would have killed it. So into Excalivir and just Mega Horn everything. I don't give a crap what comes in, just an Mega Horn it. Just die, die, die. I'm sick of it. What are you going to do? You're going to get Mega Horn straight to the face. He's going to lead seed me. I don't care. So I'm just, you know, doing whatever. This is the Choice Band Max Attack, you know, Excavalier, which I call the Megalon. It's a clever name if you get it. 
But uh, I actually hit it, so I break the sub out and gain some HP. So he's just gonna keep subbing out. And then, you know, the whole point, like, I get the whole point of trying to be behind a sub, but I guess he got tired of it and just went for the fire punch. I would have probably done that a little sooner. But, uh, you know, I guess at that. So, of course, Jolteon's gonna come in, and I'm going to kill it off. And I come back with the game. So, that was a really great game. Very close. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you did. And uh, like the video and comment and subscribe, guys. I will see you all later.